historic moment. Uh, we can now project the winner of the presidential race. CNN projects Donald Trump wins the presidency. The business tycoon and TV personality capping his improbable political journey with an astounding upset victory. Donald J. Trump will become the 45th president of the United States, defeating Hillary Clinton in a campaign unlike anything we've seen in our lifetime. Donald Trump wins the presidency of the United States. He is now going to be called president-elect Donald Trump. He's walking up right now. You see him right there. He's going to be speaking momentarily. He's got his wife there. History has been made. Jake, this is a moment a lot of people are going to remember. Well, the first time in the history of this country uh, that somebody who has never held any job in government or the military being elected to the presidency, he is going to be moving from Fifth Avenue to Pennsylvania Avenue. I think it's a moment that a lot of people in his inner circle did not even think would ever happen, but it was a decisive win. There are still outstanding states that we haven't even called yet. But because his win was so overwhelming, we're calling it right now. He's there with his wife, Melania, his son, Darren. Uh, he's going up to the microphones. Uh, he's going to be having a victory speech. I assume he'll mention the phone call he received just a little while ago from Hillary Clinton in which she conceded. She congratulated him on becoming president-elect of the United States. Dana, this is a moment few anticipated. Except if your name is Donald J. Trump, who said Brexit plus plus. And we'll analyze the results, but that looks like that's exactly what this is right now. So many things to look at and think about in what the new Trump-led world here in Washington is going to be like. A Donald Trump governing, a Donald Trump taking over the institutions that he called rigged so many times. And here he comes to the microphone. Donald Trump uh, is going to speak. Thank you. Thank you very much, everyone. Sorry to keep you waiting. Complicated business. Complicated. Thank you very much. I've just received a call from Secretary Clinton. She congratulated us, it's about us, on our victory. And I congratulated her and her family on a very, very hard fought campaign. I mean, she, she fought very hard. Hillary has worked very long and very hard over a long period of time, and we owe her a major debt of gratitude for her service to our country. I mean that very sincerely. Now it's time for America to bind the wounds of division. We have to get together. To all Republicans and Democrats and independents across this nation, I say it is time for us to come together as one united people. Time.